Hello everyone, it's me ASMR welcoming you to my new Photoshop tutorials and today I'll show you the amazing outdoor portrait editing. So let's see what was the previous image was. So this one was the previous one and after one you are getting like that so you are getting uh, amazing look of these photographs so how to do that let's see here i have done something let's see what i have done here so at first here i used preset which i made it earlier and i'll give you that preset download link for the preset download link please check out my video description and here i use a plugins which is the skin finer for the skin smoothing and color of the skin adjustment and here i use a fake light or that is the extra light and overlay actually light overlay and then levels and then the color so i'm copying this color code when we need that color we'll use that and then this one i used here uh, just merge it and then use the cross processing from the nick collection nick collection is the another filter of the photoshop and uh, that is the plugins and you can download that things that means that plugins by using or by checking out my video description and here i match that photo and i enhance the sharpness of that photo so that's for this tutorial and let's start the tutorial if you are new in my channel please do subscribe and hit the bell icon for the new notifications at first go to the file and open up here the image the image uh, just taken by shuri bhai and uh, big thanks to him for these photographs and um, he, i'll give him uh, that preset which i made it and uh, uh, that is the brotherhood so thanks shuri bhai first press ctrl j for the copy of this layer and after that i'll go to the filter and camera filter and after that i'll insert that preset which is the xmp file and camera filter this one is the plugins of the photoshop creative cloud version by default but you are the user of the cs version good news for them you can get download link from my video description so go to the small menu and go to the load settings options and here the preset that is the urban girl and open it up so you are getting the look of that and hit the ok button after that it will take time to load it up and now i'll increase the face color and skin color so how to do that go to the filter and the photo toolbox in skin finer skin finer is a plugins of the photoshop if you want to get the download link please check out my video description so from here this color correction at least the uh, skin color so here the saturation will decrease and the brightness will increase here and contrast as well and shadow yeah that's fine and highlight will increase a little bit so the before one color and after one you are getting this type of color and hit the ok button so it will take time to load it up and give you the final out loading up the loading bar just showing here but uh, one thing is that the other ambient light just uh, gone that's why i'll bring it back how to do that so make it mask and make it inverse mask so i'll just change the color of the skin not other colors so how to do that go to the brush tool and take the brush which is the first one brush of your brush palette and just make it increase the brush size by pressing third bracket opening and make the reset the foreground and background color and make this one white and then just brush over here so when you're brushing be careful so i'm brushing all the things not only the hair and other stuffs but also the all the things but i leave the lips just because of lips color i need that only the skin portion not the other portion so that's good if you need you can change the brush size by pressing third bracket opening and closing so you have that assumption to make it out so here so this portion this portion as well so yeah that's fine the before one and after one the highlight or the glow of skin color so that's good and now i'll use the another color which is uh, coming from the right side that is the color or light coming from the right side take a new blank layer and go to the foreground color and pick color from here so you can pick up color from here and just press the ok button and then go to the brush options and make the opacity 100 percent flow 100 percent and make the brush size 
like 300 pixels and the first one brush and just click once and press ctrl t and make it bigger like that and adjust the brush yeah that's good so if you need you can make it bigger yeah hit the tick button and then go to the blending mode and make it screen so it's taking yeah that's fine adjust the light that's good that's fine and now i'll use uh, no, levels from the adjustment layer go to the adjustment layer and go to the levels options and adjust the level like that yeah that's good and then i'll use a color filter so go to the adjustment layer and go to the solid color so what color we'll choose this color so this color code i'm just copying this one and just pasting in this color palette and hit ok and make the blending mode into soft light so you're getting the color correction of like that so this one is amazing i think select all the layers which is just i made it here and make it group make it merge after merging that i will apply a preset which is from the nick collection you can copy this layer or not uh, it's up to you so go to filter and nick collection and color effects pro 4 i already told that color effects pro 4 or nick collection that is the plugins of photoshop if you want to get the download link please check out my video description so it's loading up the color effects pro 4 yeah that's fine after loading it up i'll use here from here cross processing i'm using cross processing this portion and here yeah which one is perfect for you you have to find it out in this case i'll use c04 and here is the strength options and highlight and shadow and you can expand this portion are 100 percent opposite 100 percent and hit the ok button so it will take time to load it up and give you the final output yeah it's loading up and the progress bar is showing you yeah that's fine so you're getting nice look yeah the look of that yeah that's fine so now i'll make group of these two layers and make it march and now i'll increase the sharpness so how to do that press ctrl j and go to the blending mode and make it vivid light and after that go to the filter and others and high pass don't make the high pass value more than uh, 9.9 .9 and hit the ok button so that's fine it's almost done so make it group and make it match so let's see the before one was like that and after one you're getting amazing look and color correction of that photograph so make your photograph more amazing by following these steps and um, all the resource files except the photographs just because of these photographs belongs to the shorty bhai and all the credit goes to him and um, he just uh, requested me to make some uh, tutorials about that that's why i'm making those things but i'll give you another stock image download link website um, now which is just given on my video description and all the plugins download link and all the preset download links i'll give you in my video description if you have any kind of question query or request please do comment on my video comment section and don't forget to thumbs up and share with your friend until the next video i may see my lip signing out today and bye bye